So going back to the hybrid type of music that I like to create, I find this very powerful synth engine in the Kronos called the Mod 7 interesting because it allows me to have up to six different waves happening at the same time on top of multiple HD1 samples. So for example, I have this sound. And what you're hearing here is basically four different wave sounds happening at the same time, plus two different guitar, distorted guitar samples at the same time. So what I really like to do is have these leads kind of synth sounds for my music that go on top of a pad or on top of a string section and let them modulate as I go playing. So one of the really interesting things that I can play around with this Rolly Seaboard is the aftertouch. The aftertouch is the MIDI CC 74 and that is super powerful because everything that I play from the bottom to the top of the Seaboard like this can be mapped to MIDI CC 74 aftertouch. So at this moment there are a couple of effects and modulations happening when I go up. One of them is that I'm having a sub oscillator sounding when I move my finger up, so like this. There's another wave sounding one octave lower from here. Now, another thing that happens when I put my finger in that way is that one of the effects of my sound, a distortion or overdrive, is activated. So I can press more like this. and I will have more feedback. So it's very expressive. On top of that, I can play vibrato and dynamics accordingly, and the resulting sound is this very expressive lead that I can basically use for probably any situation that I'm working with. And one of the really cool things that I like doing is layering up with uh, pads like this one. When I work on my DAW, I have Rolly Equator, which is a wonderful synth engine made by Rolly uh, that automatically works with their instruments, uh, multi-polyphonic instruments, which means that they use different MIDI channels in order to be so expressive, in order to give different notes their pitch, independent pitch, independent vibrato, independent dynamics, so on. So one of my favorite sounds in Equator is a French horn that I found and I edited um, in order to create a sort of like a lead type of ambient sound that I really like to use. And I was able to recreate that sound here in the Kronos using the HD1 engine, which is sample based. So what I did was creating a French horn patch and then adding a bunch of effects on top of it, like a long reverb, a stereo chorus and things like that. And I also changed the um, the envelope generator in the sound to make it ease in the sound better and ease out. So this is an example of that sound. So it's very expressive as you can listen. Uh, and now the great thing about this instrument and the fact that I'm running the sound in the Kronos is the fact that I can play it polyphonically in a combi. So to be able to do that, I have to go to my computer and change the setting of my Seaboard instead of single to multi. When I'm changing it to multi, what I'm telling the Seaboard is to take a number of MIDI channels 
and the Seaboard is going to play those MIDI channels out of whatever equipment it has connected. In this case, the Core Chrono. So I'm going to head and do that, and I'll be right back. So I brought back my Rolly Seaboard to my Chronos. And now, after putting it in multi mode, I can play different notes like this full chord, and maybe vibrate one of the notes like this one. or this one. And to do this, the way to do this is to bring a combi in the Chronos that has the program that I created previously for the Seaboard and duplicating it as much as I want the MIDI channels. So if I'm using only four MIDI channels in this case, I'm gonna have to use four different tracks with the same sound. Each one of the tracks has to have a different MIDI channel assigned to it so the Rolly can speak to the Chronos nicely. And then on top of that I have a piano sound underneath that I can accompany my sound with. The beautiful thing about this is that every sound is coming out of the Chronos and it's very expressive, it's really easy to improvise, sit down and create ideas and recording on the go and have a lot of different possibilities with these instruments.